Hello, friends. Today we're going to talk about Mesopotamia. So they had the first civilization. They ha- had to have a king, and they believe God. So polytheistic means all of this. So they are polytheistic people. The rain gets really rainy, like pouring. So. Well, not about the gods. Well, but they had to have a king because the king need to lead them to build that thing. If they weren't the king, they'll say, "Hey, I won't build that. You build that. Hey, no, you build that like that." So the king says, "Who build what? The ziggurats or temple-like pyramids?" But the Egyptian pyramids are still there, but the ziggurats were kind of messy and broken because they're made of mud, actually. And the Egyptian pyramids were made of stone. Oh yeah, and the king only lived there. If the rainy season comes, uh, the ordinary people come and stay there too. For one or two days, and when the river not overflow, they come back again. When the river overflows, they go back again, and they use cuneiform. So cuneiform. So you can see the symbols like this. So that is the cuneiform, and these are the word. So they first start with the object. They draw it all the time, and then it became a picture, and then it became, I think, upgraded picture, and then it became a cuneiform form, and then it became a word. So let's see a few of them. Well, the ox is already here. Now the fish started like this. And then became this, and then became this, and this, and so on. Now a duck is like this, and then this, and then this, and then this. So it's not really a duck. It's a yeah, it's a bird. They make the first point in the story of Gilgamesh. So they write the cuneiform in the mud pad, and they write, and then they dry it. And the problem was they were easy to broken. So they need teachers and students and scribes and everything. So they had a high, highly education. Education means hmm? education means to learn, to teach,、mm. to record. Right, something like yeah,、that. and they make the first story point.、Mm-hmm. Gilgamesh and his friend, friend in Kadu, and the Battle of Umbabaya. So Gilgamesh was a king. He wrestled with、uh, in Kadu, and then they were both too strong, and then they both tired off, and then they became friends, and then. And then, even better, they became brothers. So they got a blessing, and then got some weapons, and then set off to defeat Humbaba.、Mm-hmm. Humbaba's Humbaba's horn was a goat, and then his head was a brain. His claws were like eagle's claws. And then his words were death, and、uh, his words were blood, and his breath was death. He was the guardian of the f- one forest. Yeah, eventually they killed him, Baba. Yeah,、mm-hmm. well, somehow. That's all. Bye. Gilgamesh had a eternal life. Life. Thank bye you for bye. listening. Bye bye. Thank you.